In this screencast, we're going to go over how to import a movie into Sports Tech Game Breaker. Sports Tech Game Breaker is compatible with any movie file type that will open in QuickTime Player. So for example, this Duke vs. UNC .mov file on my desktop here, if I double click on it, it opens and you can see it will play in QuickTime here. So I know that that's compatible with Sports Tech Game Breaker. So I'll go ahead and quit out of Sports or out of QuickTime Player, launch Sports Tech Game Breaker, and create a new project. And I know this is going to be Duke versus UNC. I want to save it to the desktop. So I'm creating the Sports Tech Game Breaker project here is what I'm doing. So I'll go ahead and click Save. That opens the project window. And then to import the movie is pretty simple. I just single click on the Import Movie button. Find the movie here, in this case on the desktop, it's the .mov file. Click open, and you can see in the bottom left there, depending on how long or how big the movie is, it will take anywhere from a few seconds to a few minutes to import. And there, it's done. It's been imported into Sports Tech Game Breaker, and now I'm ready to start coding it. Now, when I close the project window, it asks me if I want to save. So, of course, I want to save those changes. And then you can see here on the desktop, the Duke UNC file just below here is the Sports Tech Game Breaker file, and I still have the .mov file just above it. So it does not get rid of or replace the QuickTime movie with the project file. They're two separate files. So that's all there is to importing. Thanks for watching.